In the fourth generation carnival, the second row center seat is incredibly useful. First, it can even be used as a table. Pull the reclining strap on the right side of the second row center seat cushion to fold the seat, and then move it forward or backward by pulling the lever on the front bottom of the center seat cushion, or by pulling the left rear strap of the seat cushion. The top of the folded center seat has two cup holders and space that can be used for a table. When you're done using it, pull the reclining strap on the right side of the seat cushion and flip the center seat to the upright position. Next, let's look at child care mode. You can move the second row center seat forward and backward by pulling the lever on the front bottom of the seat cushion or by pulling the strap on the left rear of the seat cushion. Move the seat along the floor rails as far forward as possible to bring it close to the driver's seat. Pull the reclining strap on the right side of the seat cushion to adjust the seat back. Now the installed car seat will be within reach of the first row passenger. So you can take care of your child and enjoy the trip at the same time. The second row center seat can also be set up to face the opposite direction. To remove the center seat, first fold the seat back by pulling the back folding strap on the right side of the center seat cushion. Remove the folded center seat by pulling the strap located on the bottom center rear of the seat cushion. Rotate the removed seat 180 degrees and slide the seat's front hook into the white mounting guide of the rear rail. If you push the front hook all the way into the striker and lightly put the seat back down, the seat will naturally join with the rail under its own weight. Check for the green indicator mark on the bottom side of the seat to see whether the seat has been successfully joined. Next, unfold the seat by pulling the right back folding strap. If you install a child seat in the center seat, a passenger in the third row can face the child. Second and third row seat facing mode is also available. To detach the second row seat, fold the seat back by pulling the back folding lever on the left side of the seat cushion. Then simply detach the seat by pulling the detach lever at the bottom rear of the seat cushion. At this time, detach the left and right second row seats, then place the left seat in the right seat's position and vice versa until all seats face backward. Slide the removed seat's front hook into the white mounting guide on the rear rail. After combining the hook and striker, lightly put the seat back down and the seats will naturally join with the rail under its own weight. Now check for the green indicator mark on the bottom side of the seat to see whether the seat has been successfully joined. Place the removed left seat in the right seat's position. Turn the center seat and place the removed right seat in the left seat's position. Pull the back folding lever on the side of the seat cushion and set the seat back to the upright position to complete the process. Let's take a look at the Max Cargo Mode seat that provides the most cargo space in its class. Before folding the third row seats, secure the seat belt and buckle with the fixed clip to prevent damage to the seat belt. And lower the headrest to the lowest possible position. If necessary, adjust the seat back to the upright position. Pull the levers on the back of the third row seats to release them. Now pull the seat backward while holding the levers and the seats will fold and fit snugly in the cargo space. The second row seats can be easily removed. Pull the back folding lever on the left side of the left seat cushion. Fold the seat back and pull the detached lever on the back rear side of the seat cushion or pull the center seat strap. Now the cargo area can fit 1,220 mm wide by 2,440 mm long plywood and hold 4,110 liters of cargo. Kia. Movement that inspires.